Um, hey, hey guys. guys. Ooh. Ooh. Look at this. <laughs> Look what we got here. This is our new home. Away from home. Yeah, so we wanted to show it to you guys. It's cold out here, so she's gonna it's go inside. Cold. I already got the heater going. I'm gonna walk you guys around outside first and we'll take a look at it. Here she is. Was very, very concerned about the weight of it. So we got a really, an ultra light, uh, 2015. Uh, however, even though it's super light, it still has a slide out, which is pivotal. We needed this for space since we're gonna be living in it. So this, uh, it has a really big, um, like a huge compartment here. It's kind of hard to see, but this like goes all the way through. So all my tools, all that kind of stuff is gonna go in here. Here's more of the slide out right here. Uh, more storage back here, which is awesome. There's a bunk. There's a bunk right here. So there's some storage underneath So that's pretty much it on the outside. I mean, she's She's a heck of a trailer nice and light. Uh, it's got an awning air conditioning Come along with me Now I'm nervous about you videoing my butt <laughs> I'm not gonna video your butt So this is it um, Dining cooking and sink we have a nice big sink, um, but this is where we'll be doing our cooking, dishes, food, fridge, the basics. Um, we have the bedroom. A good amount of space in here. We were really passionate about the north and south bed, which we got, which was awesome. And then we have space in here for clothes on either side, which is really nice. Our entertainment center. Okay, and then at the back half of the trailer, we have the bunks, which was also something that we could not sacrifice because we needed a place to put our gear. And we have all kinds of cupboard space over here, which is really nice. And the bathroom, which is fairly good size. We were also passionate about having counter space. That's important to us. Some trailers and RVs don't have any space next to the sink and that kind of bugs us. And then there's our shower. And yeah, this is our new home away from home. We wanted to show you guys. The next time you guys see this, it will look much different. We are going to be doing remodeling to it, painting, changing a lot of stuff out. Um, and so we wanted to show it to you guys before we did that. Hey guys. We just discovered that there is water damage in the trailer. We actually knew there was some water damage. We didn't know how bad it was going to be. Steve peeled back some layers today to reveal that it's actually worse than we thought it was, which is a bummer. However, pretty much anything is fixable and it just takes a little more time, a little more money, but it's okay. Well, the good news is this isn't impossible to repair. everyone i went to the optometrist yesterday for the past about, probably about a week i've been seeing out of my left um peripheral of my eye i've been seeing flashes of light and i used to work at an optometrist office and i know that when you see streamers and flashes of light you need to go in and make sure everything's okay and they did a scan of my eyes and he did see something that warrants me going to see an ophthalmologist. So your eyeball is filled with vitreous gel. Sometimes what can happen is if the gel is like moving around or causing problems, it can tug on your retina. If bad enough and untreated lead to a retinal detachment. And so when they did the scan of my eyes, he did see an area that was cause for concern. He did say it's possible that I might have to have eye surgery <laughs> and they might tack it down with lasers if it's pulling away. But I'm staying hopeful that I won't have to have eye surgery um, just a couple of weeks before we have to pack the house up. <laughs> hey guys. Hi. Thank you so much for watching our video. We obviously have not left yet. No, we are still packing up, still doing stuff. We're tired, sore, sweat. Over overworked. Reek. We reek. I reek. I need a shower. I haven't had a shower in a couple of days. 
Uh, but we just wanted to pop in, give you a quick update on how things have been going, what we've been doing. A huge thank you to our very first Patreon subscriber. Russell! Thank you so much for, for subscribing, we appreciate it. There's a special thank you coming your way. Uh, thank yeah. you video. A video just for you. Definitely. No one else. As our first Patreon subscriber. Hmm. Please stay tuned for our next update video. It's coming. You can follow us along. Please share. Like. Subscribe. Comment. Help us out. Help us. We could use your support. Thank you. More videos to come. Love you guys. Deuces. <laughs>